Why hello you amazing beautiful people and welcome back to another first time reaction video So we've been checking out so many artists from Japan all different artists all different genres all different styles out of Japan And it has been so much fun exploring the J-rock and J-pop freaking catalogs and the recommendations you've all been throwing at me It's been amazing and recently a name has been popping up and uh, I really want to check this song out I don't know anything about this. What I have heard is that this is a band that the um, the lead vocalist passed away in 1999, but they have a recent album. The album's been gaining a lot of traction, and I've been getting, I've been seeing this pop up quite a lot. So I'm very curious about this band, and I really want to learn more. So let me know who are Fishmans? Why do you guys want me to react to Fishmans? Who are Fishmans? And I think it's about time we finally heard a song by them. So please put your recommendations down below. If you enjoy this reaction, press the like button, subscribe to the channel for more, and let's jump into my first time ever reaction to Fishman's with their song Crazy Baby. I don't think this video has the lyrics, so after we check out this reaction, we're gonna check out the lyrics at the end of this video. <laughs> Almost like a reggae pop feel to this opening as well. When did this video come out? What a really nice voice. What a really nice voice. Soft tones, like high notes, beautiful freaking vocals. Really nice. Really love the subtle tones. I have to say, this is incredibly unusual. The instrumental is so different to what I imagine. I wouldn't call it J-pop, like or the usual J-pop I hear. It doesn't feel like pop. It feels more like reggae indie, you know, folk. It's got a real nice feel to it. It feels very retro as well. There was a note there, like a, almost like a voice break, which to me would imply that this is quite an emotional song. Listen here. You hear that like vocal break there? That usually implies that the song is quite emotional to the singer. Because what you are seeing there is a bleed of emotions behind the lyrics there, which is very, very nice. It mean, it just shows the personal touches that are being put in the, in the, uh, in the vote from the vocalist in this performance. Such a nice voice. But it, I'm feeling like emotional from this. It, I, don't, I don't know if it's the song. I, I like, may, like, may, like. I always feel like, um, like, sometimes you can feel the emotions without understanding the lyrics. If a song has like a sad tone to it, and I, I don't know, I'm kind of getting that. Like, there's like an emotional kind of sadness to this song. I don't know if I'm reading it wrong. It's weird. It, it's very unusual in with its like, um, but in a really good way. Like, I can't compare them any other band I have I have heard 
They completely stand out. They sound so unique. They have a wonderful tone. They got a very mellow nature that feels like a sort of 80s, 90s, like soft rock like band almost, you know? Like very calming, very relaxing, very soothing. You know, like I said, indie folk, reggae sort of feel. And they're like beautifully done. The vocalist has such like a soft tone. It's, if, if this, this, this is the kind of vocalist that you could just imagine getting curled up in bed with like a blanket and they just sing you a lullaby, like such a beautifully soft voice as well. But the music video seems kind of fun and silly. You know, the band members are jumping around. This is the kind of band I'd love to see on a show, like the first take to like get to know them a little bit more, you know? I might have to check out an interview from them. I love how the video has been done. It, feel, it feels very old school, very retro, and I really like that. The video feels like I've taken a step back in a time machine or something. And the instrumental is so unusual. Like, what instrument even makes this sound? I'm noticing a sort of love for dogs. We've got a lot of dogs in this video. interesting i like it's amazing the emotions this is stirring up in me because like just seeing that scene of like them playing in the park and you got these kids around it kind of made me feel like this song could be one that like like it like takes you back to those like school days as well and it is weird that it does that because it also feels like quite a mature adult song but has like a weird like childness uh, like a childlike innocence to it too it is so this is so multi-layered and complex. I'm looking forward to reading the lyrics after this. This is like, this, 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 this band is really like no band I've heard. They are, they are, they are amazing. They have got such a unique sound. And they're still, they're literally releasing a new album now. This song's, is this one of their older songs? Is this like a re-release or something? When did this one come out? I want to hear some of their recent stuff too. <laughs> What an awesome voice. I love his voice. It's so mellow. God, it's got such a retro feel to it, especially with all the, the smoking. That's <laughs> so random. You don't really see that much anymore. What instrument is this, by the way? What instrument is am I hearing now? What is that sound? They got such like a Beatles look going, don't they? <laughs> With the hair and the even like everything, I love it. The outfits. Such an old school vibe. Ooh. Ooh, got like a jazz feel here. With the piano and that like that bass, the snare drum. What an unusual group. What a unique and bizarre sound they have. This is so different. This is so different. I never expected them to sound like this. 
I cannot wait to check out some of their newer stuff as well and see if they've maintained this sound. What a unique sound. What a unique style. What would you even classify this music as? What genre is it? What a strange video. What an interesting style. What amazing voice. What bizarre instrumental. This is such a... I'm hooked, man. I'm hooked. Who the, who the hell are Fishmans? Who are Fishmans? Who are they? Right, let's read these lyrics. Let's read these lyrics. Fishman's lyrics. Uh, for Baby Crazy? Your face always came to mind whenever I was feeling sad. You're always the one to smile whenever I was feeling sad. People have always needed an invisible force. So when I see a sad night, it reminds me of you. The starry sky shines outside my window. You threw an invisible magic spell. You threw it somewhere I can't see, or at least that's how it felt to me. You're incredible, baby. You're crazy, baby. Blow a kiss to the gaps in the night. My baby on a moonlight night, you're crazy, my baby. And then that repeat, uh, repeats, even when you're feeling down, baby, you're crazy, my baby. Your face always came to mind whenever I was feeling sad. You're always the one to smile whenever I was feeling sad. Remember I said that this song seemed to have a weird, um, sad undertone? It makes sense now. The lyrics are sad. It's, it's one of those, like, sad but uplifting songs, you know? The lyrics themselves being very sad, but at the same time, sadness in love is always 50% sad, 50% love, you know? Like, that's what these lyrics are. They're, they're sad, and they break your heart a little bit, but they're a sad song that is about love, you know? Feeling this feeling of love for someone, and, and, and feeling this attachment to someone, and loving this person. And, and you that's very obvious in this song. Um, yeah, I always find it hard to like properly analyze a song that feels sad but is about love because on one hand it's happy, on one hand it's sad. And I feel like Fishman's did, did a fantastic job at, at bringing those kind of feelings, those kind of emotions through that song. A song that felt sad and happy, you know? The music video showcasing them all jumping around and having fun and the elements of happiness. But the song weirdly... Despite it's like it's feeling, despite it's instrumental, having this like undertone sort of darkness to it is incredibly unique. I can't, com I can't compare this song to any other song, anything I've heard, any other song I've heard, anything. Fishman's completely have cemented themselves in a league of their own. I have not heard anyone like this. I can't categorize the genre, the style. It is so unique. I so want to hear more. They are a group that I'm really curious to like hear them live as well. It's amazing, like listening to more music from Japan and discovering like different sounds and styles. And I feel like I just did that with Fishman's. What an incredible freaking song this was! For so many random reasons, I did not expect, and I had the best time reacting to this. Somehow felt very emotional, but also very fun. I don't know how they've made this, but this was this was actually wonderful. And this was really good. So unique. Fishmans. Who are Fishmans? Please let me know in the comment section down below. If you want to go support them, support their album, support this song, you can do that. A link in the description to everything I reacted to. Make sure you go check them out for yourselves and go show them tons of love. And yeah, let me know a little bit more. Who are Fishmans? Thank you so much for checking out my video. I really appreciate it. If you enjoyed my reaction, please like and subscribe. And I'm really excited to read the comments on this one. This is a group I'm very curious about. Nearly made me cry, but just sitting here smiling as well. Amazing use of emotional lyrics here. And brilliant instrumental. Just, fa just a very unique group. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. And as always, my friends, you will see me in the next video.